cold front. It's moving through and we had a little bit of rain earlier near Pompano Beach. There might be a sprinkle here or there, but overall it's a drier, cooler pattern we're in for. Yesterday I did warn you that we could see some record heat and that indeed was the case. Miami hit a high of 86, shattering the old record and we are waking up instead this morning with the upper 60s, 69 in Miami, 67 in Fort Lauderdale, 71 in Key West. It feels nice out there. It's a little cooler for inland areas. 65 in Homestead, 67 in Opelika, 66 in Pembroke Pines. So yeah, about four, eight degrees cooler in comparison to yesterday. And highs today will not be in the mid to upper 80s. Will be 10 degrees cooler and back to normal in the upper 70s as we'll have the wind flowing out of the north off the land and that helps to make it feel really comfortable. The humidity is already dropped. You'll notice a difference. And then as we head into next week, we'll start to see a better chance for some showers ahead of our next week cold front. But yeah, today will feel much more refreshing and comfortable as we head into Saturday. Sunday, the humidity will start to creep up because the winds will be shifting off the ocean. And then as we get into early next week, we'll see another slight dip in the humidity. But tomorrow morning will likely be even cooler as some inland areas will dip down to around 62 in Kendall could see even the upper 50s further inland and the mid to upper 60s along the coast in Pompano Beach, Miami 65 tomorrow morning. You'll need a sweater or jacket if you're an early bird and heading out and about but by the afternoon. It'll feel nice. 80 degrees with a low rain chance could see a few showers on Sunday as temperatures begin to creep up and then spotty showers next week back into the 80s.